Good afternoon, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com. And we're doing that. 2016 Bowman's Best Baseball. Eight box. Pick your team number 28. That's right. Because this stuff is great. There it is. Ta-da. Here are the people involved in here. Saturday on a Saturday. Thanks for making this part of your Saturday. Break 28. Bowman's Best Baseball. The best of the best. There's everyone in on the action. Ben with the last spot mojo and Dodger Joe mojo. And there's everyone else right there. Thank you. Why is Rick? Oh, yeah, because Rick. This is the for the thing that I... You know what that means. Okay, cool. All right, here we go. Another case in the store right now. JaspiesHobbyland.com. This should be pretty easy to fill. So, And we have plenty of time in the broadcast tonight. So if you want to run it back, I would be more than happy to. So now we, we saw, well, we saw the new Bowman. We saw 20, 2017 Bowman baseball recently on, on jazbeeshobbyland.com. So later in the year, they'll do another best, right? So this is, this is all Chrome cards, and it's, uh, and it's what you think it is. It's really just the best of the best. So it's a pretty cool set. All right. Good luck, everybody. Let's do this. Let's do this. All right, so let's do a quick roll call. Who, who is in this break? What team do you have? I know TJ has the White Sox and the A's in this one. More AJ Puck, I think, right? And I keep forgetting who you search for on the White Sox. More Carlos Rodon? I think. Who, who does everyone else have in here? I know Adam Wilson is here. Adam Wilson's got a couple teams, right? Or a team. I see you with Braves. I don't know who else is in the room right now. I know David Kist is in here somewhere. He's got a couple teams in this one. Oh, Charles is here. Yes, you have the Giants. I see you with the Giants. Rodon, right. Uh, we've got... Oh, Joe Ivers, right? Mets. Ben's got a lot of teams in this one, too. Nice. Okay, good. Excellent. So we've, got a, we've got a good crew with this Bowman's Best Break. Thanks very much for filling this up, this up everybody. Uh, we've got Indians for Joe. Looking for the Robert Stevenson. I think there's only one of those, right, Nick? All right, D-backs for Jason K. Good. We've got a good crew here. All right. All right, we're going to lead off with Daniel Murphy and Manny Machado. And his, and his slow his slow run around the bases at Fenway. Just jogging. Our first autograph is a Met. Justin Dunn, dun 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 dun. That goes to Joe Ivers and the Mets. There you go, Joe. We'll set these right here just so we can keep track of the autos that come out of every box. There's Bregman, and we'll be uh, um, what you call it, randomizing these. So left or right, using those mirror image cards. There's a one per case version of that, so uh, we can. We'll randomize that one separately is what I was going to say. There's Andy Pettit. And next auto, Aaron Blair for Adam Wilson. And there we go. That was the first. Move this out of the way. That was the first mini box. And the next one. All right, there's out of 250, Noah Syndergaard, who said he wasn't injured. I'm fine, he said. Let me pitch. I'm I know my body. I'm fine. That goes to Joe. And then the autograph is David Dahl. Nice one for the Rockies. Mary Lou with the Rocks. I think he should be back somewhat soon, right? From the DL. Which I believe would put, put Mark Reynolds back on the bench once they put Ian Desmond back on first. Sleeve up the Syndergaard as well. All right. Should expect one more autograph. 
And that's going to be Blake Snell for the Tampa Bay Rays. And that goes to Alex Lindsay. All right, so there are your four autos. And that should be it. Remember, Vet Base doesn't ship in these, but inserts like this will most definitely ship. Slide these over. All right, so Rockies, Rays, Mets, and Braves. Nice. All right, next one. I think, I forget who the auto is on the Diamondbacks. Uh, I think Braden Shipley might be an autograph, no? I don't know. I should. I should have. I should have had the checklist open. I forget. Diamondbacks fans, Arthur, where are you at? Who's the, who's the auto for the Diamondbacks or Joe P? Maybe. Oh, Anthony Banda, right? There you go. Thanks, Jay. That's right. Is there anyone else? I thought there was maybe one more. No Socrates Brito. Can't make a burrito joke if he's not in there. And then, of course, there, there could be any number of, like, low-numbered parallels or something like that. Uh, yes, sir, Dave. You got the Orioles as well. The Orioles don't have autos. That's why they're only ten ninety nine. But, um, you know, you can get a Manny Machado, like, numbered card. You can get a one -oh, Super Fracker Manny Machado. That'll... Take care of that 1099 and then some. Yeah, I don't know who the vet autos are. I don't know if, uh, for the Diamondbacks. I don't know if they have one. You know what? No, I'm curious. Oh, I do have a checklist up, so this will be quick. Uh, Diamondbacks. You have Paul Goldschmidt, Anthony Banda, and I think that's it. They couldn't have been too much, right, price-wise? So Anthony Banda is your autograph, and Goldschmidt will be like the sort of low-numbered cards that you'll be looking for. All right, next is Cal Quantrill and for the Dodgers, Gavin Lux. Nice, the Dodgers prospect for Ben Martin, last spot mojo, Dodger Joe mojo. Nice. All right. And Kent Maeda back on track, it seems. Just saw his insert there. Ooh, orange. There's Miguel Cabrera. So even this, even though this is a vet base card, because of the refractor, the atomic refractor, it will ship. Wow, orange Dansby Swanson. Eleven out of thirty-five. Yeah, we haven't seen a lot of Lux. It's pretty difficult to hit. Think of all twenty-eight. We may have seen him of the twenty-eight cases we've done. Right? How many times have we seen him today? Five. Uh, Danby Swanson, 11 out of 35, orange. That goes to the Braves, Adam Wilson. And another orange? Orange, Josh Lowe, 25 out of 50 for the Tampa Bay Rays. Another one for Alex Lindsay. So you got the Snell, you got the Josh Lowe. Bonus auto? No, no bonus auto. All right, next one. Yeah, I can't. I can't imagine we've hit. Yeah, I know TJ got a couple luxes, but I can't imagine we've gotten more than five out of all twenty-eight cases. You know, and there it is, Anthony Banda for Jason K. This is the auto. So you're set. <laughs> oh, these are the three autographs. So we should have one more auto to go. And behind Buster Posey is Lucas Giolito for the Nationals. Nationals edition, Mike Coster. He's with the White Sox now. But that'll go to Mike and the Nationals. Oh, and there's Ben Intendi. I knew this was a numbered card. Out of 25. 250, that is. 100 out of 250. Still nice. Michael Van Wy, Red Sox. That might be a rookie of the year right there. All right. So... 
Nationals, Rays, Diamondbacks, and Dodgers. It's turning out to be a pretty good case. We're seeing some of the autos that we don't see too often, like that Giolito and Lux. Uh, Joe wants a David Wright short print. Uh, all right. Hey, it doesn't hurt to ask. And remember, we have another uh, fresh case of this Bowman's Best up on the website right now. Uh, all on-card autos, four autos per box. That's 32 autographs total. That's a that's a pretty good uh, that's a pretty decent return on a case. And I and there's usually like one kind of big uh, vet uh, veteran auto. Or like a like a top second or third year player kind of auto, you know what I mean? So and like a, I guess like an up and coming star kind of autograph, or like a proper like really nice veteran auto. We've seen I think in one of the first cases I've done of this, we saw like a Buster Posey autograph come out of this case. We've seen some pretty nice stuff. So mostly prospects, but there's a chance to hit a big uh, big veteran card right here too. All right, and hey, Justin Dunn, another Justin Dunn for Joe Iver, starting your Justin Dunn PC. Uh, for Seattle, David Kist, um, they've got a lot too. They think they have Tyler O'Neill, the ton autograph, right? They got Kyle Lewis and Drew Jackson, I think. So they, there's a few autograph opportunities for, for Seattle. We see Seattle relatively, relatively regularly. Here's Will Myers. And behind, what, the number three overall pick? Ian Anderson is Jorge Mateo. For the Yankees, Bronx Bombers, John Parker. All oh, right, yeah, Drew Jackson's now a Dodger, right? What trade was that? Was that the... No, that wasn't the Grant Holmes trade. That was someone else. It'll come to me. There's J.P. Crawford. 29 out of 50 for the Phillies. That goes to uh, Gabriel, I think. Yeah, Gabriel. And A.J. Puck. Oh, yeah, DeYoung, right. There you go, T.J. T.J. with the A.J. Puck. Oakland A's. Nice. Nice. And a Blue Jay, Anthony Alford. That goes to Gabriel, who who's actually looking for a Vladimir Guerrero Jr. We haven't seen him too often, but the, you got an Anthony Alford though. That's a start. And a green Julio Urias autograph. Wow, fifty-four out of ninety-nine, a bonus auto for the Dodgers. Ben Martin, Dodger Joe Mojo. I, he's pretty much in the majors for good. And there he is. Isn't he starting tonight? Or is McCarthy starting tonight? No, Kershaw's starting tonight. They pushed McCarthy start. That's right. Oh, the Dodgers are already three, up 3-0. Three Good. Good. All right. So there you go. Ben Martin with my Dodgers hitting big. So you got the Lux and the Udius. And 54 out of 99, a numbered auto. That's pretty strong. All right, almost halfway there. Oh, there's got to be a Ahmed Rosario in there somewhere, Joe. We usually see a decent amount of him. David Wright might be a little bit tougher. Conforto? We've seen a Conforto. Right? Not too many of him. We've seen Steven Matz. 
a number of times. Matt and Rosario and Dunn we seem to see pretty often. All right. So, great case so far. Let's keep it going. Oh, Conforto's a redemption. Gotcha. We've seen him a few times, though. We've done 28 of these. This is our 20 or 27 of these. 27 and a half at this point. We've seen, a, I think we've seen Conforto a few times. Yeah, that's a tough, that is a tough one. You know who we haven't seen in a while? This would make Gabriel very happy. You know who we haven't seen in a while? Mickey Moniak. I think we saw him a f maybe four or five cases ago. And when we first started, when this first came out, I remember like our first three or four cases, we had Moniacs, and then there was nothing for like 10 cases or something like that before we saw the next one. So uh, there's Michael Fulmer. Uh, oh, that's that always confuses me. I always think that's like a numbered... Parallel or something like that. There's Jameson Tyon and there's Ton, Tyler O'Neill. And that goes to David Kist with the Mariners. From my understanding, he can hit a ton as well. I think he's back off the DL, right? Gary Sanchez. There's the uh there's the dirt bike racer. I don't know why they would put him in this set. And Kyle Lewis. There are your Mariners, David Kist. Chance at one more, too. And Austin Meadows. Why are they calling up Austin Meadows? 34 out of 250. That goes to the Pirates. That's for Ben Martin. This way, I suppose. Oh, this is nice. Sometimes these are autographed. Gliber Torres, 89 out of 150. Yeah, he should be up this year, right, at some point? That's what, that's what Baseball America thinks. Projected MLB debut, September 2017. Yankees, John Parker, I believe, right? He has the Bronx Bombers. I can't see it. Yes, there it is. The next autograph looks like a Blue Jay. Anthony Alford, another Anthony Alford for Gabriel. Oh, do they? See, I haven't noticed that. TJ saying Mariners hit in the same box every time. Same mini box or same master box? Adam Wilson noticed that too. So when, when there's one Mariner, there's usually another. And Mike Clevenger. Nice autograph for the tribe. Joe Fagundis with the Indians. Nice one, Joe. Those should be our autographs, unless there's like another bonus autograph. Nope. That's it. That's a normal box. But a nice box. All right. So we got a couple Mariners. Got a Blue Jay and an Indian. There we go. Nice. Just about half. We are halfway there now. Four boxes left. And we still have not seen our uh, our veteran auto yet, so we can still keep an eye out for that. Uh, 16 autographs to go, so do not despair if you've not hit yet. Plenty of time. Plenty of time. Yeah, all, all it takes is one, you know? All it takes is one nice hit to take care of you in this break. Right. 
Next one. Good luck, everybody. Here we go. Tyler Glass now. Start us off. And there's Kyle Lewis, Atomic Refractor. And we've got Alex Bregman. Wow. This has been a great case. Nice Alex Bregman for the Strohs. That'll go to Nicholas I. Nick I with that one. And what does that look like right there? We've got Royals, Garrett Davila. Royals Auto going to Ben Martin. Lindor, behind Lindor is, this has been quite a case, Andrew Benintendi. For the Red Sox, Michael Van Wy. We got Julio Udias, Gavin Lux, AJ Puck. We've got Orange Autos. All sorts great inserts. It's been a pretty good, uh, pretty good case. Should be one more. 229 out of 250 and a one of one Gavin Lux for Ben Martin and the Dodgers. Wow. <laughs> I am stunned. Gavin Lux, the 2016 Dodgers first rounder. Wow. I saw the gold peek out of there. I was just like, is that just going to be a gold pair, like just a regular Super Fractor card? Didn't think there was going to be ink on it. Definitely did not think it was going to be Gavin Lux. Wow. Ben Martin, all aboard the Big Hit Express with that one of one. Woo -woo! What a case. Yeah, last spot mojo too. So we got Ben Intendi, we got Bregman. And the luck, wow. We do have another case. We don't have. <sighs> Gabriel, welcome back. Uh, two Anthony Alford autographs. No Phillies. Uh, there was a JP Crawford like numbered card to 50, but no ink. So that's a pretty nice one for you, Ben. I don't know, did Ben fall out of his chair? I haven't seen a reaction from him yet. Or maybe he's lagging behind a little bit. Oh, definitely not. Definitely won't happen again. <laughs> there we go, there's Ben. He's like, that's nuts. He's stunned. I think he was like the number 20 like overall, first rounder, number 20 overall, but but pretty highly rated. He's a high schooler, so it's going to be a little bit of time. They'll probably move him from, from shortstop. Or they might move Corey Seager. I, don't, I have no idea, but I think it'll be a little bit of time before we, before we can expect to see him in the, uh, in the majors, but... Like honestly, that 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 is one to just like keep and hold on to it for as long as you can, you know. Like if you can afford to hold on to it, I would. All right, Cal Quantrill. That's Paul's kid, Padres. That goes to Rick T. Atomic Ichiro and a two, out of two fifty, Michael Fulmer for the Tigers. Uh, that will go to Detroit. Jake Johnston and there's Albert Moore and then Elias Diaz. Nice one for the Pirates. 
Ben Martin with the Pirates. So Ben hitting all over the place. Next autograph is another Anthony Banda for Jason K. And Kyle Lewis for David Kiss and the Mariners, 56 out of 99. And behind Clint Frazier is Alex Kirilov, Twins. That will go to Lee. Oh, and here's the one per case mirror image right there. And there's Conforto in the back. Oh, you've, you've pulled one from a pack recently? Wow. Yeah, that Lux guy is following you then. So Twins, Padres, Pirates, and another Diamondback. Well, he, he's a young kid, but he's he, supposed to be... Supposed to be a good one. I think he, I think he's 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 expected to be in the. I mean, I guess any first round pick you would expect to be in the majors, but it's not like he was like um, like a high upside developmental guy. You know what I mean? I'm pretty sure that that Gavin Lux is, from what I remember, is is pretty uh, is pretty solid and should progress up the minor league ranks uh, relatively steadily. Well, where do you move him? Yeah, one dude is blocking Lux, but I would imagine they would either move whoever has the better glove, right? I think Lux might have, might be scouted to have a better glove, I think. But you got to move one of those guys to second. Second second base is kind of a hole for the Dodgers after, you know, well, after Forsyth, basic, basically. He's Forsyth's not the future. So what, you move, maybe you move Gavin Lux to uh, to second. Or Corey Seager to second, or move Seager to third. You know, Justin Turner's not getting. I like Justin Turner a lot, but he's not getting any younger. Well, the one thing that, that, that my daughters do have is uh, is flexibility. You know, yeah, Seager to second maybe, but they've got flexibility. They got guys that can move around a little bit, and that's that's the one thing the Dodgers front office really likes uh, in a player. So look at Cody Bellinger, who's been raking, right? Cody Bellinger can play first base, can play can play left field. So if he couldn't if he couldn't play left field, Bellinger wouldn't be up right now. It's his positional flexibility that allowed him to get called up, and oh, he'll probably stay up too. It's Cano and wow, David Ortiz, what a case! Twenty one out of fifty. Hitting safely, David Ortiz, Michael Van Wy with the Andrew Benintendi, and now a big boppy. Woo! What a case. Bregman in there too? Wow. He might get called up soon. Colby Allard for the Braves. It's one for Adam Wilson. Well, I, that's your vet auto right there, folks. Or retired auto now. It's kind of weird not seeing him play. And there's Dylan Bentances, 95 out of 99 for the Bronx Bombers. And behind there is Ahmed Rosario. That will go to Joe Ivers. Should expect one more autograph, and we'll get to the last box. Behind Mookie Betts is another Alex Kirilov for Lee. And that should be the box, unless we find another Julio Urias bonus auto. No, didn't think of There's the dirt bike rider and Xander Bogarts. And, oh, sorry. Nice David Ortiz. 
Okay, last box, ladies and gentlemen. Well, this case was marinating, that's for sure. This case was marinating, and, and you know what? Well worth the wait. Very, very nice. So thanks very much, everyone, for filling this up. Like I said, we've got another fresh case on the website. The last handful of cases we've done of Bowman's Best uh, have been pretty hot. So I don't know. I don't, I don't know what's going on, you know. But but we've been pulling some really nice stuff. I mean, in general, this is always nice. The 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 ceiling and the floor of these of these Bowman's Best are pretty are pretty narrow. You know what I mean? The ceiling isn't super high and the floor isn't super low. So most of the time you're getting, you're always going to get a solid case out of this stuff, you know, but we've, we've seen, we've seen some cases recently that have been a lot better than the ceiling. The ceiling is the roof, ladies and gentlemen, the ceiling is the roof. Jordan said it. Uh, I think, well, I think it's it's called a super fractor. We, we call it a super fractor, yeah. The the one of ones they'll call a super fractor, yep. I've not seen Vlad Jr. yet, I'm afraid. Michael Fulmer, it's our last four autographs. There's Buster Posey out of 250 for the Giants. That goes to Charles. Riley Pint. Nice. He's another one of their their uh, high prospects right there. Man, the Rockies will be scary if they get decent pitching. Mary Lou with the Rocks. Nice Riley Pint. Nola. And a green auto. Wow. You may as well start a rainbow. 56 out of 99. Gavin Lux autograph. Green. You got it. You have to start a rainbow now. What else are you missing at this point? That is crazy. I gotta find that other one now. So, you got the one of one super fractor. That's the hardest one to get. You got the regular base auto, right? The, re the refractor auto. And now you have the green out of 99. All you need Ben Martin is the orange out of 50, the atomic refractor 25, the red five and the printing plate. And then you got the rainbow. So now you have to do it. I mean, you had to do it with a one of one, but now you have to do it. <laughs> Mickey Moniak, there he is. What a case. Are you kidding me? Mickey Ammoniac for Gabriel. Someone tell Gabriel that he got a Mickey Moniac. Do you see? He's on mute right now, I think. But there it is. The Moniac. The Lux out of 99. Oh, let's keep the Lux out of 99. Out of. So these are your three autos. Riley Pint, one of the Rockies' top prospects. Mickey Moniac, the first overall pick in 2016. And, of course, Gavin Lux out of 99. Wow, one of the Dodgers' highly touted prospects that was drafted last year. Crazy. And one for TJ. Franklin Barreto at the end. So TJ gets the AJ Puck and the Franklin Barreto. A little extra auto for TJ. Thanks, man. And another Buster Posey for Charles. This time, this one is out of 99. 34 out of 99. And there you go, folks. Man, what a break. I mean, we got the Julio Urias, which was a bonus auto. We, we saw the Gavin Luxes. Big Boppy was the uh, was the vet auto. We saw Andrew Benintendi in here. Um, there was Lucas Giolito. Uh, and what was the, there was another big one. 
I mean, they're all... Oh, Alex Bregman was in there, too. Insane in the membrane, folks. Insane in the membrane. Hey, you're welcome. You're welcome, Joe. Okay, so, uh, I got a quick randomizer to do. And the Moniac. And the... A couple quick randomizers. So these will be for all the mirror images we have now, left and right. And then we'll do the mirror image, a tonic left and right. Your best break ever, Ben? Well, that's a pretty damn good break. All right, so let's go to random.org. Nice, good. Yeah, if you have two, Gabe, keep one, grade one. Oh, that atomic, sorry. I don't have to, that saves me a little bit of time. I just realized that the atomic are both Marlins. So this is a one per, I don't know how much crazy value this has, but it's still a one per case, Mary Lou. So there you go, Mary Lou with the Marlins. That was easy. So we just have to do left and right for all of those. All right, let's roll the dice. Let's randomize that nine times, four to five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth and final time. Right side gets them. That'll be the right side right here. Both the front and the back, the right sides are the same. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. What a break. What am I supposed to say after this? This is Joe, jazpyshobbyland.com. Rewatch the video for the amazingness. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.